Well, good morning, tubers. Little update here, Thursday morning update from the Lone Duck Campground right outside of uh, Manatee Springs up here on 24, sitting at the foot of Pikes Peak, basically. Uh, we've got a spot, a couple, that, couple of places down here. I don't know if you'll be able to see it or not, but that's our tent right there. And Nellie Bell's tucked over there. I just thought I'd do an update from the stream over here, let y'all know what's been going on. Uh, Linda got here last Friday. We had a couple of uneventful days until Saturday night when my alternator went out and we got stuck in Colorado Springs, which is where we currently are. Uh, I got my van fixed Monday morning, but unfortunately, I mean, just the weirdest thing. I mean, we got two old vans. A 93 and a 99 caravan with over 300,000 miles on the both of them combined. They both decided to break down at exactly the same time. So my fix was uh, accomplished Monday morning uh, and uh, was not too bad. It was a shorted wire. Unfortunately, Linda's van appears to have lost the transmission, and it's currently in the shop. Probably going to take about a week and $800 to fix her van. Of course, she's a 1,000 miles from home, and I'm just down the road, you know, from, from uh, Fort Collins, so, and my van's running. So anyway, we've offloaded everything into my van. Her van is in the shop. We're probably going to stick around this area, maybe even this campground, until we can get her car back. Uh, which is probably going to be pretty close to the end of my vacation time next week. So, I don't know. It's been a mixed bag. Uh, Linda and I get along okay, uh, you know, even given the pressures that we've been under. Uh, you know, nobody's biting each other's head off. And she's a nice enough gal, probably not my gal, but, uh, I, we're, you know, we're good friends and, uh, you know, we'll see how it goes in the future. I mean, it took quite a bit for her to drive out here, uh, you know, on her own. Of course, she's considering relocating out here anyway for uh, the medical marijuana because she's taken pain pills that are pretty strong and she'd like to get off those. That remains to be seen how that works. But in any event, uh, I got about another week of just lazing about and uh, we're going to go play golf this afternoon I mean I say we I'm gonna go play golf this afternoon she's gonna drive the cart um, so I'll probably do an update from the golf course it's a mountain course I'm looking forward to the views weather is threatening today I don't know if you can tell if I scan up here to the sky but there's uh, a haze and the clouds and 80% chance of rain or something but I'm not just going to sit here in the campground. Uh, I'm going to, you know, these the rains come and go, so we'll see what happens. But uh, yeah, and I had, you know, some other bad luck. I've I've managed to drop both of my iPhones, you know, iPhone 4s's, into Bandit's water bowl, uh, which is going to make doing my videos quite a bit more difficult. Uh, I'm using my I'm using one of my iPads right now. But uh, I'm probably going to have to do something about replacing uh, the phone. I, I don't know. We'll see. I might can get by with an iTouch uh, using my Sailor router. Uh, the, the GPS does not work very well on the iPad uh, cell router connection. And uh, unless I want to buy a separate GPS unit, which I don't. I think I'm probably going to have to get something that, that works better. My iPhones, even though they didn't have uh, service, uh, seem to keep better track through the cell router and the, uh, the GPS turn-by-turn uh, -turn worked pretty good. Um, I don't know if an iTouch would do that or if there was some trick in my iPhone even though they, they weren't connected. They still had their, their SIM cards in there from Germany. Um, 
if they were getting some kind of location that was helping that along, I don't know. But I'm down. My tech, my tech is 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 on is on the wane right now until I upgrade it. So it's going to be a little bit more difficult to do the videos. I'll figure something out in the long run. But uh, yeah, I got a 1:30 tea time. It's probably about uh, an hour and a half from there right now, and uh, so I need to get going on that. But you know, it's been a, it's I've had a lot. I've had a great time. We've been. Uh, sightseeing we did the manatee springs thing uh we went out for dinner a couple times uh went for sushi last night and she's not a sushi girl so you know i don't think that was as exciting for her as uh, i had hoped it to be but um you know we're getting along best we can so uh i'll update as uh, i get time and bandwidth uh i tried to do a live feed earlier on uh Facebook, but yeah, I got cut off after about 15 seconds because of the uh, sketchy bandwidth up here at the campground. So I'm going to try and upload this one before I take off the golf. And uh, you guys comment uh, in it anything that you uh, want to see. I'm going to try and get some more pictures. I lost two days worth of really good pictures when my iPhone landed in Bandit's Water Bowl. So I'm sorry I can't share those uh, from Manatee Springs and and some of the other uh, other stuff we got from Cheyenne Mountain Canyon, but um, I do have other cameras, and uh, I will get those uh, pictures out as I see fit. So I had a great day yesterday. I'm having a pretty good day today, and of course I plan to have a good day tomorrow. So until then, I'm out.